My name is Helmin Rambaldo and I'm from the Netherlands. Um, I guess my first experience is just uh, being, a, being a player. So I've got an experience in being a national cricket player and um, I've also worked in coaching uh, national under age groups and the ladies team for, uh, for a long time. I've previously worked in education at the Amsterdam University of Applied Sciences and I've also uh, worked as a freelancer on sport for development projects. Um, so I've been teaching for ISBM now for two and a half years. So I teach all the PPD courses in every year. I'm also involved in the research courses and sport development. Um, well, I think if I look at PPD, I think it's very, very important as a future sport manager that you are actually aware of what your strengths and weaknesses are and that you're able to reflect on every single situation. I think that's a must in, uh, in the working environment, not only for yourself, but also to help others in their development. So I think that's really, really important. Um, sport development is, uh, is um, besides that is one of my, my, one of my passions, I think using sport as a tool to address other challenges, um, especially uh, in the community is a very important um, yeah, aspect. And then the research courses, I think it is a need and important because we need to be critical these days with information, the way that we actually get the information ourselves, but also the way when, um, when others tell us things, I think it's important that we're critical so that we can um, decide for ourselves to use this type of information or not. Um, I, like, I really like teaching the ISBM students because, um, well, they're such a, yeah, such a diverse group. So students from, uh, from a variety of, uh, of different countries, which actually always, um, well, they actually also teach me things because of the background, so the differences that they have. Um, I also like it because um, I feel that the students are motivated and make a conscious choice to, uh, to come study here. Um, and I also can really recognize um, what it's like moving abroad since I did that also uh, many times in my life. I know that it's such a great experience for your life to actually move abroad. So I really like teaching students who have moved abroad because I just feel that that's such a big important phase of, uh, of their lives. Um, my advice for the future ISPM student, I think um, uh, as, uh, my approach is always to, to avoid uh, giving advice, <laughs> but to ask questions. So let's just turn it the other way around. I won't give advice, but I'll ask questions. Uh, why, why do you want to study um, uh, ISPM? What is it that you want to get out of this study? And uh, what are you looking forward to? Uh, to the most to develop. That will be my questions to the future ISPM student instead of my advice. <laughs>